The Kremlin says it will continue claiming Ukraine may have plans to use a radioactive dirty bomb on the battlefield. There is no evidence to support that accusation. And while Ukraine strongly denies it, Kyiv says such rhetoric is a Russian false flag operation in an effort to justify the use of such weaponry. CBS News senior foreign correspondent Holly Williams is in Kyiv with more on this. Good morning, Anne-Marie. Well, yesterday, Russia took its allegations about a radioactive device known as a so-called dirty bomb to the United Nations Security Council. The U.S. has dismissed Russia's accusations of a Ukrainian dirty bomb as transparently false. The U.K. ambassador to the U.N. called it, quote, pure Russian misinformation of the kind we've seen many times before. And Ukraine suggested Russia could be laying the groundwork for a so-called false flag operation accusing Ukraine of what it actually plans to do itself. Now, a dirty bomb is not a nuclear bomb and would be less harmful. But by using conventional explosives to spread radioactive material, it's an effective weapon of terror. Yesterday, President Biden was asked whether Russia could be preparing to use a dirty bomb or even a nuclear weapon following its accusations about Ukraine. I'm not guaranteeing you that it's a false flag operation, he said, but it would be a serious, serious mistake. Ukraine has asked the UN's nuclear watchdog to inspect two sites here that Russia claims are involved, though once again it hasn't given us any evidence of that. Anne-Marie. Holly, thank you very much.